Hey, what's up guys? So today we're back out on the lake, but we're not gonna go fishing. Today we are gonna film down there. I wanna see what's down there. I wanna see what the bottom looks like. I wanna see what it looks like looking back up. I wanna see the fish schooling around because yesterday when we came out, came out here, it was like there were so many fish. It was wild. So yeah, I got my GoPro. I'm gonna drop this thing down about 10 feet. See what happens. All right, first things first, let's break a hole. Now let's get some warm gloves on, because yeah, that needs to happen. And now we're going to carefully and idiotically attach the GoPro to the end of my line. And now we fish. That was awesome, wasn't it? And honestly, there were so many more fish. I just wish I could have like turned the camera to show you guys, but it was hard. The way I was doing it was kind of lame because I'm stupid. I, I forgot the pole. I was gonna use a pole. I was gonna attach the GoPro to the end of the pole and then stick it down there and be able to control, but yeah. I just, I forgot the pole. I'm sorry. Hey, at least we got video, right? Like, it was a little scary, honestly, using my fishing pole to try to get the camera to go up and down. And I was like walking in circles, trying to turn the camera so you guys could see like around the lake. But hey, you know, I'm just, I'm glad that we got anything at all. Anyways, obviously it's late. Uh, we're back home, Kristen's here. And now we're gonna cook up the fish that I caught yesterday. And uh, I have to tell you guys, I didn't show my catch mainly because there's a lot of people out there that are very sensitive about fish and animals and they don't like uh, things being hurt. I have to tell you, uh, for those of you who are, are very sensitive about that, this is something that I do. It's not something that I'm just like, hey, this is fun, let's catch them and throw them in the trash. No, I eat them. I do. And the only ones that I take home are the ones that have lived. They're wild. I'm not buying them from a store. They're not, you know, raised in a, in a, in a farm, you know. These are fish from a lake that were born and raised in this. Well, okay, some of them might have been planted, but again, the ones that I caught were big and they lived a full life. So I just, I wanted to put that out there. I never take home the small ones, so. Uh, also, um, I don't really know how I'm gonna make them <laughs> because I looked on YouTube, I was like, where's my thing? Oh, it's back there, my iPad. I looked on YouTube and I tried to find a bunch of different recipes and there was one that was really funny. It was like how to prepare salmon and I was watching it and this little girl, like after the, the guy made it, he made this all, this big nice video about it and like right at the very end, the girl tastes it. She's like, it tastes like rats. And I was like, oh my God, that is freaking hilarious. Like the guy puts so much time and he's just like, ah. But it was like real life, so it looked the best thing ever. And it looked really good. But uh, I'm gonna honestly try to figure my own thing out because this is what I do. This is my first time cooking like fish for her. I've been talking about it. I'm like, I'm really good with fish. I just finished cleaning it. Like I had to kind of go back and like remember how to do it. And I watched some YouTube videos, but they didn't really help me. And I was like, oh damn, I messed the first one up. I, you know, I still got all the, the meat off of them. And then the last one, it was so perfect. I was like, damn, that was like my smallest one. And I got so much meat off that thing. So I'm really proud and, and my mom would be super proud. My family, I just, I know I talk about my mom a lot in these vlogs. It's because I love my mom. You gotta, you have to love your mom. If you don't love your mom, that sucks. I hope you love your moms. I hope you love your, hope you love your families. Going off topic here, ADD. So anyways, um, yes, I'm gonna go ahead and say goodbye. We're gonna cook this stuff up. Again, I, I don't know if I wanna show the fish because I just, I don't know, I, I feel, I'm back and forth. I, I feel bad for the people that feel bad. And um, it's hard, you know, like I, I, I wanna show it because it's a part of me, it's a part of my life. 
It's something that I love to do and it's something that is, is built into me since I was a child. You know, making, making fish, making food, making yeah. stuff like this. So, anyways guys, thanks for watching. Tomorrow, her and I are gonna go fishing. I don't know if we're gonna show it. I really don't. <laughs> I, think, I think if we're gonna show anything, it's just gonna be the building of the tent that's gonna go over and maybe just a couple of shots of her. But, um, <laughs> cause I want to say she's never been fishing. Like she's no. been, have you, no, wait, have no, you been? No, not really. No. <laughs> okay. We're vlogging because we have to see her for first fish, but we're not going to stick to like the lakes around here. We're going to drive really far somewhere we've never been. So you know what? We're vlogging. We're going to do it. We're going to vlog. I'm going to, I'm going to use the auger. The, oh, the, 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 nice. finally, I'm going to yeah. use it. I've never used it. I saw somebody using a, a hand a hand crank one, yeah. and dude, I was like, I wish I could have had one of those, but nobody had them. But also, those things get like the smallest holes. The holes are just like that big, but the auger that I have is like, boom, like ten inches. <laughs> like you can you can pull something massive out of there. But uh, I got some. Um, I'm not gonna tell you where I'm going because I, I got some kind of like secret inside information on a really good lake. Nice. Yeah. So it's going to be really cool and I'm sure it's going to be really beautiful. So even if you're not into fishing, it's going to be something cool to see. And I'll probably, you know, I'll bring the GoPro too, because I'm sure it'll be like a lot deeper and there'll be a lot of different fish. At the same time, this lake is a, it's a, it's a, it's a stocked lake. Like there are fish that are there all the time and then there are, they kind of replenish every now and then. But the, the lake that we're going to tomorrow is not stocked. It's like the fish are there and they're big. They're not as many, but they're really big. Mm -hmm. So, cross our fingers. Anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and say goodbye because I need to cook this fish. I'll see you tomorrow. Goodbye!